Nicholas Byrne and James Adam Byrne, Jr. is an Irish singer-songwriter, radio and TV presenter, dancer and former semi-professional footballer, best known for being a member of Irish music band Westlife. He was the band's oldest member. Before his music career, he played professional football, representing Republic of Ireland at several junior levels. Since then he has had a successful TV presenting career. His wife Georgina is the daughter of former Tower Sage, Bertie Ahern, and they have twin sons called Rocco Bertie Byrne and Jane Nicky Byrne and a daughter called Gia. On September 7, 2012, it was announced that Byrne would be a contestant for the 10th series of Strictly Come Dancing. He was ranked number two on Ireland's Sexiest Man of 2014. Career equals Football equals Byrne was a footballer and played for Home Farm and St. Kevin's Boys in North Dublin. He became a professional player, and joined Leeds United as a goalkeeper in 1995, and was a squad member of the FA Youth Cup winning team of 1997. He played for Leeds for two years, leaving when his contract expired in June 1997. He played in a reserve game for Scarborough FC and in a trial game with Cambridge United before returning to join Dublin club Shelburne. He then signed for Cobb Ramblers playing 11 games, then St. Francis FC, all in Ireland's League of Ireland. On May 14, 2009 Byrne was a substitute for a Liverpool FC Legends 11 that played against an All-Star 11 in a Hillsborough Memorial match to mark the 20th anniversary of the Hillsborough disaster. All the proceeds from the match went to the Marina Dalglish appeal. He represented the Republic of Ireland at U15, U16 and U18 levels. He is a fan of Celtic FC, and on August 9, 2011 played in a Celtic Legends 11 at Celtic Park in front of a 54,000 crowd against a Manchester UTD Legends team. Byrne participated in and won Soccer Aid 2014. He scored in the match, played at Old Trafford. He was the only non-professional player to score in the match. The rest of the world team won the game 4-2. Equals music equals. In June 1998, Byrne attended an audition for new Irish boy band, where boys and manager Louis Walsh approached him to join his new venture, Westlife. Byrne joined Westlife along with Kian Egan, Mark Feely, Shane Fillon and Brian McFadden. Byrne revealed in Westlife, our story that he had wanted to change the name of the band to West High. But the others preferred Westlife. With Westlife, Byrne has had 25 top 10 UK singles, 14 of which, were number one, seven number one albums and has sold in excess of over 45 million records worldwide. It is certified that Westlife have sold 20.2 million records and videos in the UK across their 14-year career a Euro 6.8 million singles, 11.9 million albums and 1.5 million videos. Byrne also had a number one single in Ireland in 2002, alongside the Republic of Ireland national football team and dust in the Turkey with the Irish 2002 FIFA World Cup anthem, Here Come the Good Times. He also co-wrote many of Westlafia Euro Show Euro S songs. Equals presenting equals, in 2002, Byrne guest hosted an edition of CD, UK with Cat Dealey. Byrne hosted the closing ceremony of the Special Olympics Live from Dublin's Croke Park in front of 80,000 spectators. Throughout the years, Byrne has appeared on Children in Need and Comic Relief several times. In 2001, he co-hosted Children in Need Live from Belfast and in 2011 and co-hosted a BBC Radio 2 radio special with Patrick Keelty for the cause. Byrne has narrated stage shows such as the Snowman Christmas Special and the Picture of You documentary dedicated to former Boys member Stephen Gately who died on October 10, 2009. Byrne has also hosted the Cheerios Childline concert, a record, seven times, which was broadcast on RTA Pamel 2, and in more recent years TV3. In addition, Byrne presented several editions of the Celebrity Sunday radio program on RTA Pamel 2 Fathoms in 2010. Listeners tuned in from as far and wide as Mexico, Chile, the United Kingdom, Philippines and Indonesia. The fourth and final edition of the program, broadcast on February 14, 2010, trended worldwide on Twitter. FM 104 publicly offered him a job the day Westlife announced their split. 
In October 2012, Byrne hosted the RTA Pamela reality TV show Football's Next Star. The series followed ten young hopefuls competing for a chance to win a place with Celtic Football Club's youth squad. In May 2013, 2014 and 2015, Byrne presented the Irish votes at the Eurovision Song Contest. He also co-hosted the short-lived TV talent show The Hit on RTA Pamela 1 along with Aidan Power. On February 4, 2014, Byrne signed a contract with RTA Pamela 2 Fathoms to host a new weekday show from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. In January 2015, Byrne started hosting the new weekly national lottery game shown, The Million Euro Challenge on RTE 1, although the show was axed that July. Personal Life Byrne was born to parents Yvonne and Nicholas. He is an older sister, Gillian, and a younger brother, Adam. Byrne married his teenage sweetheart Georgina Hearn, whom he met when they were about 12 years old. The two were married on August 5, 2003 at the Wicklow Register Office, Wicklow, County Wicklow. The civil ceremony was followed by a church blessing on August 9 at the Roman Catholic Church of St. Pierre et St. Paul in Galadon, Aray-Loire. France and the reception at the nearby 16th century car sent to Clement. Georgina gave birth to fraternal twin sons, Jay and Rocco, on April 20, 2007, born eight weeks prematurely. The children were baptized on July 15, 2007 in the St. Sylvester Roman Catholic Church in Malahide, County Dublin. On April 29, 2013, Byrne announced on his Twitter page that he and his wife Georgina were expecting their third child, and on Irish television it was announced that the baby was due around Halloween. Daughter Gia was born on October 23, 2013. Godparents for the children are Byrne's sister Gillian Byrne and her husband Mark Gallagher and Georgina's sister Cecilia Ahern and Byrne's brother Adam McGarry Byrne. Byrne's father, Nicky Byrne Sr., died on November 3, 2009 from a heart attack. Westlife's promotional tour of the UK was cancelled as Byrne flew to Dublin to be with his family. Byrne S. R. sang part-time on Dublin's cabaret and karaoke scene and was presented with a Harley Davidson motorbike by his son on his 60th birthday party the year before his death. Equals Philanthropy Equals, in 2010, Byrne and his family organised the Nicky Byrne Twilight Ball, a fundraising event in memory of their father who died in November 2009. The event raised over a 200,000 and completely funded a television and radio heart attack awareness campaign in connection with the Irish Heart Foundation. Byrne, and his wife Georgina, are keen supporters of the Irish Premature Babies charity. Byrne also supports UNICEF and has taken part in several UNICEF campaigns, such as the UNICEF Euro for Zero campaign where the goal was to raise as much money as possible in November 2010 for child survival programs. References External links, official website